to the Mum's Eye View channel. Today I'm going to be making a really simple and healthy bolognese recipe with you. It's one of those recipes that is handy as a mum because not only can you make adult portions so myself and my husband can have it but I can also puree it. Oh no he dropped his carrot. Give him another one quickly. I can also puree a couple of portion sizes for my seven month old baby son Grayson which obviously saves a lot of time as a mum because you're not cooking separate meals for everybody. So I'm going to pop him down and show you guys what you need for this recipe. While I'm cooking, if Grayson's in the kitchen with me, I usually give him a couple of finger foods to keep him occupied. So right now he's got a little stick of carrot and I've also got a little bit of red pepper for him. Oh yeah. <laughs> Just keeps him occupied while I'm making his food fresh. These are all the ingredients that you're going to need for this recipe. I've got one onion finely chopped, I've got one carrot chopped up, a pepper and a courgette which I have skinned 400 grams of tin tomatoes. These are cherry tomatoes because they're a little bit sweeter than normal tomatoes and Grayson likes the sweet food. 200 grams of mushrooms, 300 grams of minced meat and I've got 150 ml of reduced salt vegetable stock. I've also got for Grayson's little portion, instead of spaghetti to go with bolognese, I've got little baby pasta shells. The first thing you want to do is just heat up a little bit of oil in your pan and then add your minced meat a handful at a time and this bit kind of grosses me out because I hate touching raw meat so I'm like Ugh. You're just gonna brown it in the pan. Red meat is really good for the second stage of weaning your baby because it provides the richest source of iron for them, which is brilliant for all their mental mental <laughs> is brilliant for all their physical and their mental development. Once your mince has browned, oh that was really awkward. Once you've minced <laughs> I can't speak. Once you've browned your mince. Once you've browned your mince, you're gonna is that right? Yes. Sorry. <laughs> Once you've browned your mince, you're just going to take your onion and pop it in and then you're going to cook all of that together for two to three minutes. After you've been cooking that for two to three minutes, you're just going to throw the rest of your ingredients in. It's so easy. So I'm just going to put it all in one by one. First, the carrots. Carrots are great when you're first starting to wean your baby because they like the naturally sweet flavour of them. Peppers. I'm going to throw in the mushrooms. They're a great source of vitamin D for babies, which you wouldn't think actually. I don't think many people know that. Next I'm going to add the courgette. I did peel the courgettes because um, some babies find it harder to digest skins on certain fruits and vegetables, so I thought just to be sure I'm going to peel the skin off. This is making me so hungry. And then lastly I've got my cherry tomatoes. In we go. So now I've added all my ingredients, I'm just going to pour in my vegetable stock and then you just want to bring it to the boil. Once you've brought everything up to the boil, just pop a lid on it and then turn your heat down a little bit. Oh, that's up. And then just let it simmer for about 15 to 20 minutes and then it's all ready to go. So it's a pretty easy recipe and minimal washing up, which is my favorite part of this recipe. And um, so while that's all simmering and getting ready to be eaten, you can pop on your spaghetti or your pasta. We're having it on a sweet potato, so you can prep all of that while that is cooking now. So I'm gonna pop Grayson's little tiny baby portion of baby pasta in a saucepan. This stuff is just so cute. It's like the tiniest, teeniest baby pasta ever. Um, so I'm gonna pop it in here and boil it for eight to 10 minutes. I'm also gonna put in the microwave, I have actually already put in the microwave, a couple of sweet potatoes for Stefan and I. I'm gonna start them off in the microwave for five minutes and then I'm gonna pop them in the oven until they're cooked when this is finished cooking. I'm just 
prepping the sweet potatoes ready for my husband and I to have our bolognese on those. Feel free to put this re recipe with spaghetti as it is intended, but I just prefer a sweet potato, I'm a bit addicted to them. Grayson's little pasta shells will be ready now too, so I'm going to take them off the heat and drain them. Now everything has finished cooking, I'm going to serve it up. Oh, it's so heavy. So I've just prepared a little a uh, plate of a sweet potato and a side salad so I'm just going to pop a couple of portions on there for us. You can also add seasoning to your own portions. I'm not going to add any salt or pepper to Grayson's because you're not really supposed to put that kind of thing on baby's food. Um, so he's just going to have everything plain. So now I'm just going to spoon the rest of ooh, <laughs> the mixture into the blender and puree it for Grayson. Just going to check if that's enough for him. Oh, it's steamy. I think he's going to like this. It is actually really good. Now, I can serve him in his little bowl, a little bit of his pasta. I'm not going to give him all of this pasta. I'm going to save it for tomorrow at lunchtime. I'm going to pour a little bit of this on for him. This is a good one if you are into making baby food and you want to make a big batch of it and pop it in the freezer so you don't have to cook as often. There we go. There's Gracie's little portion. He's going to really enjoy that. Now look, how cute is this? We can all sit down and eat the same dinner. <laughs> oh, he's awake, perfect timing. His dinner might be a bit hot though. Let's go get him. <gasps> Hello. How did you have a nice nap? Are you ready for some bolognese? <gasps> Come on then, let's go have some spaghetti. Ready for some bolognese? <gasps> yes, mummy. I think it's going down pretty well. Yummy? Thanks for watching our recipe on bolognese, baby friendly bolognese. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to the Mum's Eye View channel and we will see you soon. Bye! Say bye! I'm a bolognese baby, I'm a bolognese baby. He wants ours. <laughs> Get me the bolognese! Chose this little uh, three piece t shirt set and they're really cute. I love the soft colours and you've got two short sleeve t-shirts one like this with the little looks like a little vest underneath this 